Assalamu alaikum, welcome back. We have started with the analysis of sequential logic circuits. Before this, in the last lecture, we have covered how to analyze a sequential circuit with JK flip flops using the method of characteristic table. Now, in this lecture, we will analyze a sequential circuit with JK flip flops using characteristic equation. So, for example, we have a sequential circuit given as here. So, as you know that the characteristic equation for a JK flip flop can be given as A of T plus 1 is equal to J A A dash plus k a dash into a. Now, this equation refers to the first flip flop where j and k are the corresponding inputs and the subscript a is referring to the corresponding output of this flip flop. Similarly, for another flip flop we will have equation given as b of t plus 1 is equal to j b into b dash plus k b dash into b. So, these are the corresponding characteristic equations of the given flip flops. Now, coming towards the analysis of this given circuit using the characteristic equation. So, the first step is determine flip flops input equations considering the present state and input variables. So, this step is the same that we have covered in the last lecture, just we need to write the input equations of this circuit. So, we have already uh, derived these equations which is J A is equal to B K A is equal to K A. If you calculate K A, it is equal to x dash multiplied with the b. So, we have b and here we have x dash. So, k a is equal to b x dash. Similarly, you can look for the other equation such as j b which is equal to x dash. Simply, it is the uh, equal to the input x dash. Okay? And finally, the k b is equal to um, XORing x with the input a. So, it will be equal to x dash into a plus a into x dash. Okay? So, we are done with the first step. Let us come towards the second step. The second step is obtain the state equations by substituting the input equations into the characteristic equation of the flip flop. So, what we will do? We have this input equation and then we have the characteristic equation. So, here we have those variables such as uh, j a, k a, j b and k b. Okay? So, if we put these, these uh, input equation values, we will get a of t plus 1 is equal to Uh, the value of j a is sorry b into a dash plus the value of k a dash is equal to b x dash whole dash into a. Okay. Find this equation it would be equal to b a dash plus a b dash into x. Okay. Similarly, the second equation would look like, uh, similarly the second equation will equal to uh, j b which is x dash multiplied with b dash plus x dash a plus a x dash into b. So, this will be equal to b dash x dash 
प्लस ए बी एक्स डेश प्लस ए डेश बी एंड एक्स ओके सो दीज आर द टू स्टेट इक्वेशंस ए इंटू टी प्लस वन इंटू देन बी इंटू टी प्लस वन ओके now these two equations are the important equations to know about the next state of the circuit okay so using these equations you can put the present values the input values and find the next state of the circuit okay so the corresponding state table for the given circuit would look like this one that is already discussed in the last lecture and the state diagram would look like this one okay so we have already discussed how to uh, draw a state diagram given the state table thank you